veterans present the colors of our nation. Please stand. And please join us as we play and sing a national anthem. tonight to the Veterans Den. We're going to be doing some patriotic songs, some also of them you'll know, like a uh, heavy join in, and there's going to be some songs from an era. We're going to do a song from the Korean War era, and some from the Vietnam War era. So the first one, I'm sure you know, it's the Battle Hymn of the Republic. If not, you'll know the glory, glory, hallelujah, that's for sure. So join us. <laughs>
next song is a medley of uh, patriotic songs. Again, I'm sure you'll know them. A long way to Tipperary. And ends with the grand old flag. Pick up in the middle. It's a long way to Tipperary.
song for a change. Um, <laughs> Um, this song is called Blowing in the Wind, and it was written by Bob Dylan, and it's covered by Peter, Paul, and Mary. Um, it's almost like a peaceful protest song. It um, asks a question, and um, the answer, Blowing in the Wind, is almost an ambiguous response, meaning it's right here around you, or, <laughs> um, or it's something you can't reach or obtain. And with that, I think we should...
and we played this song. And when we were leaving, after we were done, you could hear you could hear the uh, students walking into their other classes singing, "This land is your land, this land." So, mission accomplished. <laughs> okay, join in. Uh, Shall we all know this one? This land is your land, this land is my land, from California to the New York Island, from the Redwood Forest to the Gulf Stream waters. This land was made for you. This land is your land. 
Okay, um, the next song is about something that actually happened in World War I, which was the war to end all wars. Um, it was fought using trench warfare, where the Allies would dig trenches on this side and put barbed wire up, and the Germans would dig trenches on this side and put barbed wire up and shoot poisonous mustard gas at each other. And, um, and then fixed bayonets that go up over the top and fight hand-to-hand -hand combat in no man's land. And it was a brutal way of war, as all wars are. And this happened on Christmas Day. It's called Christmas in the Trenches. Oh, my name is Francis Tolliver. I come from Liverpool. Two years ago, the war was waiting for me after school. From Belgium and to Flanders, Germany to here. I fought for king and country I love dear. T'was Christmas in the trenches and the frost so bitter hung. The frozen fields of France were still, no Christmas songs were sung. Our families back in England were toasting us that day. Their brave and glorious lad so far away. I was lying with me best mate on the cold and rocky ground When across the lines of battle came a most peculiar sound Says I now listen up me boys, each soldier strained to hear As one young German voice sang out so clear He's singing bloody well, you know, the partner says to me one by one, each German voice joined in in harmony. The cannons rested silent, and the gas clouds rolled no more, as Christmas brought us respite from the war. Sung. 
of the walls they had kept between us to exact the work a war had been crumbled and were gone forevermore. Thank you. 
agenda is the World War II Memorial. I had the experience to have traveled with 25 World War II veterans and their families for the dedication of the World War II Memorial. That trip will live with me forever. I wrote and dedicated this song to those that went on that trip. One of those that went on is with us tonight, Flo Jibo. And her husband, Harvey, who was uh, up in heaven, a World War II veteran. Uh, D-Day, the Battle of the Bulge, great, great. Uh, it was a great trip. I know Harvey's in heaven looking down. And uh, it took 60 years to do it, but you know what? It's there and it's a beautiful monument. I wrote the song. Father. It took sixty years, but it's finally here. A World War II memorial. A World War II memorial. A gold stars shine bright for the ultimate.
We fired our cans till the marrow melted down And we grabbed an alligator and we fought another round We filled this heavy can up all the powder deep behind And when we touched the pot, it was the day lost the mind Proceeds of this are going to go to the Northeast Outreach Veteran Center, Center, uh, Center in Havel, who do an outstanding job for our veterans in the Merrimack Valley. And also to the Launch Vietnam Memorial Scholarship Foundation. You can see the names of those that were, uh, lost their lives in Lawrence up there on the flag. And the 50 50 raffle, we're going to continue to honor David Ouellette at Central Catholic on his scholarship that. Uh, we have uh, teamed up with Pearl to remember David, a Vietnam veteran. So we'll be back in a few minutes. Thank you. Uh, we have a basket for uh, a goodwill offering. Uh, there's no, uh, obviously, there's no cost to the price, but uh, with the goodwill offering, this is how uh, we can help our veterans. So Ellen's got baskets. We're going to pass them around if you want to drop something in. So we'll take a, take a few minutes, 50 50. So thank you. This next song is a medley of all our um, five branches of the service. So we're going to play it and sing it. Hoppy's going to uh, ask that when your song is sung, if you're in the service, if you're in the Army, Navy, Air Force, Marines, the Coast Guard, you stand up when your song is sung. All right? We haven't mixed up, so you ready. <laughs> not, not. not.
while through the yonder, fly behind into the sun. Here they come, coming to meet us. protest songs from the uh, from the Vietnam War era and uh, the first one is uh, The Eve of Destruction sung by Barry McGuire back in 1965 it was number one on the, uh, the hit parade and the second one is Fortunate Son by John Fogarty from Creedence Clearwater Revival and that was done in 1969 it was number three on the hit parade and Rolling Stone voted it the 99th most popular song out of 500 all time songs. So it's one of my favorites. So, so. And we have a guest appearance today. We have John Hayes. Oh, yeah. We have John Hayes. Son.
song, I'd like to introduce the band here. To my right, Ed Murphy. Our singer, Tambourine, you she's Lauren, Lauren Gadget. To her left, her, her dad, Al, Al Gagnon. A drummer who gives us the beat, Tom Everson. On bass, Ed Hayes. On guitar, you heard him, John Hayes, very talented young man. He's in the McCoy High School band, does a great job. And you have Strolly and Hoppy Cummer. Okay. <laughs> Just like at home, right? Okay. <laughs> Gotta get up for some ice cream. I got some? <laughs> Jay Jesus close, huh? Oh, 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 oh. All right, this next song is uh, that I wrote is the fighting in Afghanistan. And I wrote it because you know, in World War II they were in the battlefields and in the, in the forest. And Korea, they're up in uh, the valleys and the the hills. Vietnam in the jungles and the air, land, and sea. But you know, today our troopers, you see it on TV, they're going door to door. A lot of them aren't even making it through the door. But they're doing it so we may be free. They're fighting in Afghanistan. This is dedicated to our troops today and those that are in Iraq also. <laughs> There they go, off to war, to fight the enemy. Young men and women to cherish their liberty. They're fighting in Afghanistan. They're fighting. Find me. They're fighting in Afghanistan. They're fighting in Afghanistan. Some will live, some will die, and we all cry. Some are family, some are friends, some. Yeah, this 
this next song is one of the first songs that I wrote. <clears throat> and I want to thank the band for helping me with the songs. Uh, I went to uh, one, of my, uh, one of my visits to Vietnam Wall in Washington. It's a beautiful statue that looks upon the Vietnam Wall of the three servicemen. And there's two ways to look at the wall. One is to look right at the wall. The other way, to look up in the sky. Now, it's your imagination to figure, are they looking for helicopters or coming out of the jungle and saying, where are we? Well, I was there, there were seven, seven young children, probably seven, eight, and nine. They were just looking at the statue. And I was looking at the children, and I said to myself, someday, they'll know it all. So to some three servicemen, dedicated to all my Vietnam veteran brothers here on the 50th anniversary of the Vietnam War, uh, 1965 to 2015. And before I sing this song, I'd like to have all the Vietnam veterans stand up because it's the 50th anniversary of the war. It's 
a, um, a ballad style, it's a love song. Um, when I first heard it, it made me think about, um, obviously past and present, um, about all the men and women who are home and they're just waiting for their loved ones to return home from war and battle and training and whatever it may be. So I think this song is perfect for anyone who's in need right now, for anyone who misses their loved ones overseas. husband, Cho, was in a service station in Japan, and I just sat home, write him a letter, and he'll tell you the truth, right, Cho? I wrote to him 365 times a year, <laughs> and my neighbor would see me go to the mailbox, and she'd say, there goes my cell. Sending that letter to Joe. And that was 1951 when he was in the service. And we've been married 65 years. And, and up quick, we were married right up here 
in this church we were married 65 years ago. And I'm Marcy cooking. I, I did the cooking show in WCCM for 10 years, so everyone knows me as Cooking with Marcy. <laughs> You don't know what's going to happen in the den. This is great. <laughs> I love it. Thank you for your service. Lauren, thank you very much for allowing me to do that. This was playing. Uh, my grandchildren called Flo, Auntie Flo. She's family. I had a great experience. Ellen and I went to Washington with Harvey and Flo. And I'll, as I said earlier, we'll never forget it. So, yes, Flo. Uh, uh, how is in heaven? Yes, he is. Okay, thank you. The next song. I'm done now. <laughs> <laughs> the next song is called The Fireman's Prayer. Um, I was a Lawrence firefighter for 30 years and I wrote. And I put music to the prayer back in 1977. I've been singing it at memorial services and at funerals. Um, Al and I sing it every uh, June for the memorial breakfast and mass, the fire station, central fire station. So I'd like to um, dedicate this to all firefighters everywhere.
singing, definitely. Um, God Bless America. And we are singing the intro that is not as well known. Um, Kate Smith kind of make, made it her signature, her um, popular um, going back to the song. And um, I just, I never really thought of the song as a, a song you would sing during mass, but um, in recent years, Dad has actually brought it back during mass, and it really makes me think about how blessed we are to live in a country where girls like me are allowed to go to school and pursue a great career, and how we're all free, and it's just a beautiful country. We live in. So.
me flame. 